Hey, what's up, everybody? Thanks for listening to the Ben Herrera Show. Anywhere you listen to your favorite podcast. You know, work it out. That's what we're talking about? Mm-hmm. <laughs> what up, everybody? Yeah, we'll check it out. Tonight's show, or it's Friday. What do you mean? What do you expect? Friday night. Uh, time for the Ben Herrera Show. We got uh, uh, our guest today, Marcos. What up, Marcos? What's up, y'all? Thanks for joining. Thanks for being on the show tonight. Uh, let me move my mic so you can hear me. But uh, <laughs> so we got Malik. Wow, somebody scratching his record over here. Scratching, scratching, scratching his record and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're talking about some eighties and stuff, but he's there scratching. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Thank you for tuning in tonight, <laughs> everybody. Right. Um, <laughs> Supersonic over here, mm-hmm. man. So, yeah, you're damn right, man. It's Friday, man. We made it. And forget another week. We made another day, man. We've been blessed to get another day in this thing. Not, not yeah. guaranteed, not guaranteed, but exactly. We here, man. Um, having fun. Having Talking fun, man. Babies. Big, big, big. Everything happening. You know what I'm saying? Big We're making thing. it happen. We're making it happen, Captain. You know what I mean? Um, Ben, nice shirt. Oh yeah! Yes, yeah, your shirt. Say that real quick. Your shirt is is. You might have to stand up. Yeah, yeah stand up for that, bud. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah baby, everybody, let's go, go, go blue. Yeah, uh, this shirt was this. made by Daniel. Her, I forgot the name of his company. Why? Why would you do that? No, I didn't forget, but I just you I didn't forgot my it. sticker. Yeah. Yeah, let's put it on Marcos. I mean, uh, let me... oh, thank you. There's no, uh, <laughs> it's that Marco. No. You, you often black, Marco. Yeah, right. <laughs> they always trying to be like us. But yeah, oh. man, uh, everybody, you know, we started this thing. Okay, I'm not going to get into that. But, um, man, good to be here, man. Um, life is good. Lions are. Doing very well in football. This <laughs> Ben is tweaking. Um, uh, yeah, on something. I just I drug don't... tested Ben, and it came out positive. Positive for everything. Um, uh, no, it, uh, <laughs> right. Sticky salmon screen print. Right. Oh. Um, if you need a shirt, you need any decals, anything done like that, get a hold of him. Um, stinky screen. Uh, or stinky salmon screen printing. Why is that more clear? What's wrong with me? Wait a minute. Uh, Squeaky. Stink, stinky. Stinky. Salmon, green printing. Stinky salmon screen printing. Say okay. that five times fast. Stinky salmon screen printing. I'm good. I can't even say it once. <laughs> Rubber baby bunky bumpers. Yeah. I forgot about it. Okay. So we're going to be talking about the 80s tonight, people. Man. So why you, that's why you brought me here because I'm old. Right. Oh. We'll be talking about the 80s. Tomorrow. We'll Marcos be talking about the '80s and, yes, it is my and, and the first time that women started voting. We're gonna let Marcos weigh in on. <laughs> oh, <bunch of> <laughs> <laughs> it looks like oh, the oh. plates behind you. Right. Oh man! Yeah, Can you Mark- see the plates behind you? Look in the camera over there. I mean the the lion's plates. Oh, you got the lion's plates back here. Yeah. Oh no, we got yeah. uh, um, Jeanette's picture. Why? Why am I forgetting people's names? You you What's wrong something with something today? I, don't, I guess. Yeah, man. I think it's because I think too much. Maybe yeah, uh, lay off the you, Red Bull. You need a nap. <laughs> right. Start sleeping like that. All right, we want to see the <laughs> break. This this nap break was brought to you by <laughs> Sealy Pastrapini. <laughs> and Rest Haven. Yeah, and Rest Haven. <laughs> Rest Haven. <laughs> Where Ben is probably about to be within the next couple weeks, right. um, if you don't get it together. Um, so, but yeah, the eighties, man. Um, that's something we all have in common. We all lived that era. We oh, all, yeah, eighties babies and parachute pants. And, 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 what, is that? That's exactly. What you know what's funny? You had some parachute pants. Oh, I know. Oh, black. Yeah. Pants, huh? uh, I don't I don't remember. Remember. It, it was, was like all gray. like multicolored. It was like multicolored. It was like there's like yeah, my mom. It, it was like homemade. No, it wasn't homemade. They was just like. Okay. <laughs> like and but they were still and see that's the whole thing and there wasn't there wasn't where I'm from there wasn't parachute pants it was called hammer pants 
notes. Hammer, hammer yeah, pants. Yeah, that's exactly that's the same Well, we thing. call them hammer. No, it's not. Yes, it is. It's not in my hood. <laughs> All right. Because we used to call them hammer pants, too. Oh, yeah, dude? Yeah, the white version. The right. Oh, just the right. <laughs> Why got to be racer on here? The right. I don't know. Yo, y'all call them sledgehammer pants. Sledgehammer. <laughs> you call them sledge pants. You guys sledge call it pants. hammer. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, oh, definitely, funny. if you had a pair of hammer pants, you was doing big things. And motherfuckers was, where yeah. would you get them from? Oh, them cold. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Oh, yeah. There goes sunglasses, kind of like yeah. right, right now. Right. The parachute pants. They don't have a high top oh, fade. Oh, they don't have oh, a oh, oh, the, oh, the Gumby fade. Huh? Look at that camera real quick. Oh, no, you can't. There we go. Oh, no, you can't see through those. I want some of those. There you go. Look at that. I'm pretty. (laughs) But I see it and I know. Oh, okay. Oh, that's okay. 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 Well, okay. So we'll take another commercial break. <laughs> <laughs> so brought to you by Baxter. So, brought to you, brought to you yeah, this by was brought to you by Ulta. No, it's oh, good. It's Ulta. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so let's go around real quick and 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 give your favorite uh, one of your eighties moment. That one of your favorite. Oh man, what's something about the eighties you remember off top besides uh, hammer pants? Well, I tell you what, right now I think my ultimate favorite. Memory mm-hmm. is when Rocky came out. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I thought I was Rocky. Mm-hmm. I always wanted to be a boxer. Here's up. Did so after every movie? Did you go upstairs in your room and reenact the movies? No, I actually went outside into the woods and punched a tree. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, that was I did. I put, only where I, I think I put I put toilet paper around my hands, pretend I was Rocky, and I'd go outside and I'd punch. Uh, okay, that's a good. That's a good. And after I was done, I'd be like. Bring it out! <laughs> no, no, Adrian. They did, they did the right, Adrian with Adrian. Sorry, Adrian. Adrian. Oh, yeah, he said, baby. Adrian. <laughs> Malik, so, yeah. you... Oh, sorry, I thought you were. No, you're fine. I don't know if I have a favorite, but I, I mean, there's a, there's a lot about the eighties, man. That um, we said favorite, not everything. Okay, <laughs> my favorite everything, just the part of the memory, All right, that fine. part of the brain. <laughs> um, I'd have to go Golden Girls. The, the, the Golden, Golden, the Golden Girl. Girls reunion. Um, yeah. <laughs> But the Blair had ass, man. I'll tell you what, Who's Blair, Blair? Blair would have got Blanche. it. Blanche. Her too. Who's Blair? <laughs> Who's Blair? It's still, Blair facts of life. still Getty that's and Betty White would have got Blair it back there. Facts of life. Um, yeah, that's true. But I have to say, um, Ooh, tootie, the toys, man. Tootie, yes. Toys. The, the yes. toys, man. The toys. The oh, Tonka trucks. Yeah. Tonka yep. trucks. There you go. Oh, one of my favorite commercials from the 80s was uh, the Micro Machines who... Look at the mind machines! Like, what's that? Was that the Spanish commercial? Huh? Was oh, it? I know who that guy was. He was the guy, one of the teachers on Saved by the Bell. Oh, was he? Who? He was the uh, the, the, guy that for... did the micro machines commercials. Oh, was was the he? No, he was um, the science teacher. Oh, the dude with the glasses. By... Yep. Really? That was him. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Really? Same guy because he did that same. Uh, role as the teacher because he was talking fast. Hello. Because when they would try to do like studies, he would say, <clears throat> like telling him, "Okay, study this," and he'll read it fast so they couldn't get it on. So they would fail. Well, that's an automatic oh, yeah. fail. Oh, yeah. Yeah. What up, Elias? What up, though, bro? I was, uh, what up? I mess his name up all the time. That's that's what I was trying to think of. <laughs> but um, <laughs> where am <I>? But uh, <laughs> so the toys. Um. <laughs> The toy thing <laughs> was um like I remember Teddy Ruxpin. I remember oh, I had that. And oh my god, Cabbage Patch Theodore, Kids. Theodore. Oh, what about the garbage? The man? garbage, garbage Pail Pail Kids. kids. Oh, oh shit, man. Rudy Trudy. Oh, yeah, Rudy Trudy. This has nothing to do with toys, but Howard the Duck. Howard the Duck. Oh my god, <laughs> so, no, we ain't get into the movies in a minute. But um, let's oh, see man. what I had. The, 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 the How Wheels. Uh, the Transformers was huge for me. I had a shitload of Transformers. My wrestling man, so I used to have all the, you know what I'm saying, all the... Uh, Jimmy Superfly Snooker. Super, oh, that was my dog. Oh. Stop it. Man. That was my cousin from another Once mother. again, everybody might have heard already, but I was at the second or third largest sports event in U.S. history. I was at WrestleMania 2. <laughs> Stop it. How like I the heard Pontiac that. Silver. Were well, you the kid crying in the back because you were scared? Yeah, was, you mm-hmm. thought it was really a real thing? I, when I, th- I cried when I found out it wasn't a real deal. <laughs> that, was, that, was like, that was last month. But, I uh, thought so. 
Miguel said <laughs> Nintendo. I cussed my mom out. Mom, what the f*** is going on? Nintendo? Nintendo in the 90s, wasn't it? No, the no Nintendo, Nintendo in the 80s. 80s. Is it really? Oh, my God. I thought it was Atari. Yeah. Atari 2. It was after. Nintendo was after Atari. Yeah, Nintendo. Atari yeah, was Nintendo first. Atari, came out Atari was like... Late 70s. Yeah, that was... And then Nintendo came out in eighty five. So damn old. When you graduated, when you, gra- <laughs> when you graduated in nineteen sixty five, we had the uh, Atari ad came out. Um, get that little, <laughs> get the, like the pong, get that pong, blink, blink. Nineteen eighty three. That didn't come out in eighty three. That came out in eighty five. What Nintendo? Yeah, Nintendo came out in eighty five. No, yeah, Nintendo ain't that. Uh, Nintendo ain't that old. Mm-hmm. Eighty three. I was. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, no. 80, it no, was like every bit of eighty five, eighty six. Tito's, Tito said, what up, Marcos? What up, what up, Tito? What's up, my brother, man? You know it. What up, though, Tito? <coughs> hey, man, I heard you had a good turnout with your tournament last weekend, man. I meant to give you a shout-out with this past Wednesday. I, I think about it. I think about it until I got home. I'm like, damn, I ain't even seen nothing Tito about this tournament. But I've seen the pictures, you know, the, the people who won it, man. That's what's up, you know, man. I'm going to say that shit I'm, I'm going to say this. I am very proud of my brother, Tito. Man, Tito, stay at it, bro. Man, Tito has, has made it from... I remember when he first began to where he was like to where he is now, and it's just like he's doing it. Right. He's and doing he, it. He's consistent. He's, that, that's that's very, the key. Tito's, Tito's very consistent. And I'm bro. proud of you, my brother. I love you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Blessings yeah, upon yeah, you and Tito, your family. I remember Tito. Tito stick out to me because he always had Jordans. <laughs> and I like, man, Jordan, man, Tito, keep the damn, keep the damn Jays. Every new Jay, you know, Tito got it. He worked hard for it. He worked hard for it. He worked hard for it. Yeah, like, right. If Tito wasn't at school, you know he was standing in line at the mall. Just waiting for the majority to come out. He outside 3 o'clock in the morning with the jacket on. What up, Mikey? Hold on one second. Uh, Nintendo came out in 1985. 85, yep. That's about right. Wow. Yep. Am I that old? No doubt. No I, doubt, Tito, we're man. Old. It? Thanks Baseball for, on Nintendo. Thanks for keeping it live around here, bro. We, we know we need that. Do really? Old conservative holler, yeah, man. Nintendo game. The, the takeover has come, man. They ain't got no choice but to let us in, bro. Let us people in, Tito. Tito, next time people you have, <laughs> Tito, next time you have one of those, we're recording it. My boy Mike Mike Modine in the building. What up, though, Mikey? That's my guy. Mikey, Mike, what's up, my brother? Big Mike, big Mike, baby. Oh, I know. Big man. strong guy. Wait a <laughs> Mike strong. Mikey stroked him. No, no, I'm so Mike, Mikey. I'm so glad you was on my team when we <laughs> played football. I'm so glad you played next to me. I don't, I'm Wait, really man. not trying to go to war with you. How old is that, Mike? Mikey. He's Mikey. Got to be about thirty. Thirty. Ah. Early thirties. No, he's, so how old is he he's, he's, he's thirty. Mikey, how old are you, bud? How old are you now, Mikey? Am I telling us? Why are you telling my business out there? Yeah, let you know. Let us know if we we can do anything too, Tito. We'd yeah. like to be there for for you, bro. PSA: <laughs> Tito's Jordans are fake. <laughs> <laughs> Mikey, thirty-seven. The Chinese version. Yeah, yeah, Mikey, I know he's thirty-seven, bro. Eleven year old. That's about those. right. The Jordan name is in Je- in Chinese language. Damn, they say Jordash. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what about British Knights? Oh, December seventeenth. Okay, British. You know they're British. coming back. Oh, yeah. BK British Knights. BK. You know they would go around telling people that was real gold. Yeah. Remember that, man? It, 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 after one wear. For bitch kickers. After three, after three wears, that whole that whole thing came off. The whole enamel. Oh, yeah. The spray paint yeah. off the thing. Yeah, people used to call them bitch kickers. But, hey, living in Flint, living in Flint, Michael Gordon. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> this Gordon sound, like some, style. sound like somebody who graduated from Zealand. That's my, uh, that's my grandpa's name. Michael Gordon's. Is for real? Oh well, apparently his grandpa's got shoes too. Yeah, I guess. Um, we used to get jumped for our shoes in Flint, bro. They're like yeah, BK, wait, bro. you couldn't go outside with, with something new, bro. I got, I got you. I'd stop wearing Jordans, bro. After I got jumped, Jefferson Street in Flint. In Flint, what's it called? Je- Jefferson, right? There was like a, a roll, and there was a bar in the corner. It was like a, it was like a little hood, and there's a little bar in the corner. That's that's the whole city of Flint. You just explained the <laughs> hood in the bar. <laughs> I just remember yeah. going there, and you couldn't do it. What's him in the bar inside the church? No, I'm just actually, there was a church across the <laughs> across the other the church corner. Bar, right? It was a church across the way. It was a church across the other side. Oh, it was a bar church, and then it was just a little hood. You, there was little kids just flipping you off, and oh yeah, flip kids, man. Yeah. And it was just like, man, oh yeah, these kids, these kids. What you shit. doing? And the dad be out there, I like, said again, these kids ain't. Shh. But uh, I got jumped for my Jordan. So interesting story. So lunchtime. 
recess at school. Civic Park Elementary is no longer there no more. Um, the building's still there, but it's not a school. Um, the water's still yeah, bad. They, yeah, into, yeah, water's still bad. Um, <laughs> but it's still surviving. Legionnaires and all. You know what? But, uh, you know what? Here's the thing: is, is Malik is actually white. It's just the water turned. Yeah, you see, you're right. It's, yeah. it's, it's, but it's, you know, you, I don't know if you guys ever knew this, but when they, um, when I was checking in for a, a doctor's appointment, yeah, you know, they asked me if you drank that fluid. The water, yeah, it's yeah. Easy, I did bro. not know that. I was like, it makes a big difference. I said, how am I going to drink? Because there's contamination in your system. They want, they need to know exactly what yeah. you're going through or what's in your system so they can diagnose it. Yeah, from that. Oh. and then they can just finish the job. I, uh, that's what I was. Thought was and then they can just grab your and then, right, and they can just finish the job. You're already halfway there. You want to just go ahead and end it now? Yeah. Uncle Vorkin's niece. Uncle Vorkin's nephew. No, your beard is itchy. <laughs> no, but <laughs> itchy. Itchy beard. Okay. Okay. So earlier we 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 were actually so, we were all in the car. We were all you know we were all and, laughing. And Ben's and, Ben's wife called. Ben's, Ben's wife called. So me and Marcos proceeded to act like, uh, act like some chicks oh in the background. God, like, man, like, is that your wife? wife? Oh my god! Oh my god! I don't like this. It's like you got a girl on the phone. Yeah, like, like for real. And I was like. Uh, <laughs> So Malik, uh, all I hear is like, back. you know what, you know what? Take your money back. Your beard itchy anyway. <laughs> oh, I lost it. Man. I lost it. I was like, I was like, no, no, oh, that's too God. funny. We are cracking up so bad. Missed the joke, right? He was the book. What happened? Who said it? What, right. What's going on? Right. You know, it, bro. Let it go. <laughs> Let it go, man. Let it go. It's, it's gone. I <laughs> wanted to. <laughs> all right, it's one of those things. Well, it's one of those things show. we had to be there. <laughs> I was there, but then not. Well, now you're here, so let's be here. Okay, now we know. <laughs> but so, so, so back to my ass getting whooped by yeah. uh, Jordans. No, you got your ass whooped. Yeah. No, I didn't get. You no, know, I didn't. Never. Well, you keep repeating the story. No, no. Yeah, no. Yeah, right. And so what happened? Right. I hope he's not listening. No, it's good. <laughs> you know, he is. So, so at lunchtime, I got into a fight with this dude. Um, dragged his ass, whooped him. Tito can come on. And so back in the day, back then, you didn't. When you get in a fight, you go to detention that day. Oh yeah. After school, mm-hmm. and they don't, they don't, they not call no parents, nothing like that. You just show up to the crib late, and then mama, well, why are you so late? You your uh, no, why are you so <laughs> late? I had detention. That's how you found the parents found out you had detention. Yeah. This is pre Amber Alert days. So anyway, yeah, exactly. Pre Amber Alert. Pre Amber Alert came out. So when we left the school, of course, ain't no kids out there, ain't nobody. It's, 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 it's us. Mm. So him and his homeboy waited for him. Yeah, and so. They go, man, I like those shoes. Y'all remember they asked me what size it was. I'm thinking to myself, I don't know. I'm in fourth grade. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, I don't fucking know. You know what I'm saying? And so one of them jumped on my neck. And from neck. behind, yeah. It's there. <laughs> it's still there. He took some with him. He but he, he jumped out of me. He jumped on from behind. And I flipped him over. Mm-hmm. And then his homeboy was right there and, like, grabbed my arm. I remember I just swore. Boom! Hit his boy in the mouth, and then I ran, ran up to the door like the school, and it was locked. And I started banging. Uh, boom, boom, boom! And right as I started banging, I seen the teacher, the detention teacher, he was walking by. Mm-hmm. My dad, she turned around. I was like, "Oh, hey!" Looking back, and she came. She opened the door, and that's that's why they didn't get my shoes though. You go, boy. Uh, they didn't get my shoes. But then I remember. Uh, Hold on a minute. You know, so you were a pair of Jordans. My uncle bought them. My, 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 my uncle kept me here. He kept me straight. That year, I remember he had me a pair of a uh, pair of Jordans. It was a fours. The mm-hmm. Jordan threes or fours. The one with the little mesh net on the side. Then he had me a pair Those of Adidas. The a pair of Adidas, and then a pair of LSAs. Oh, Elite yeah. or the Elise. Yeah. Boy, that was the shit. Oh, he had shoes on lease. Nah. All right. Shout out to Renner Center, by the way. Shout out to Renner Center, by the way. I promise I'm going to put you on back. Hey, the 80, speaking of lease, layaway. Yes. Oh, my God. What happened to layaway? They still got layaway. Sir, what, not where? Oh, they got a, it's a place in Muskegon. Oh, they ain't here? I guess it's in only impoverished cities. Um, <laughs> <laughs> nah, we were right. It ain't Flint. They, they got one in here, too. 
At this place called Foreman Mills. She can throw a little way there. They still got a little way to certain places. It's, it's just still not big. in Holland. I mean, it was big. In the <laughs> just not in Holland. Remember? I was like, what the hell is that way? Oh, what the hell is that way? It's so Boy, crazy. Are you tired? <laughs> <laughs> We got a rafter if you're going to get a bed. Day you get that you get a daydream you bed. Yeah. Daydream bed? The daydream bed? Your futon bed? Your, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Your couch bed? Yeah, I remember. That. Daydream, that's what it's yeah. called. The shoes of the fashion was the shit, though, in the 80s, man. Uh, like, uh, Aaliyah said K Swiss. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Like, hey, kitchen that. You have those? Oh, you have K Swiss K Swiss, baby. Oh, they're not on camera. And that's when I found out Adidas mean all day I dream about sex. Oh, I didn't know that. What? That's why I wear them? No. I'm playing. Uh, Don't take me serious. I did this show. That? All day I dream about sex. No, we, everybody. That's Adidas. Adidas. But I'm saying, I'm, I'm kidding. Always, oh, oh, yeah. The way here, and there was a song. Uh, <laughs> you should have heard him sing that song. Yeah, uh, who was that? Um, I'll pass. I'll pass when that made a song like that. So the corn. So the corn. Mm-hmm. Well, they, they, they copied Outcast. No, so, that song came up. Oh, maybe it was about to say. Uh huh. See, I told you. I don't remember. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but, um, oh, would you, you I was just—I'm still talking about fashion, <laughs> like far as like you know, shoes. I miss the shoes. The Adidas with the fat laces. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, my and the Adidas, and Adidas, mm-hmm. Adidas suits with the, oh my god, that was a uh, LL Cool J sports yes. suits, the suits, and the Kango sweat suits. The sweat suits was it. Did you see him on the the New Year's Eve? No, I did not. It, it was crazy. crazy. Think it about crazy. that 80s fashion. I was kind of busy on that day. So 80s, I, I, all the way through the 90s, but 80s fashion is back. Yes. The, oh, uh, yeah, is. And you know what's the, the biggest part about the 80s fashion, uh, the fashion now, that I was major 80s back then, it was like frowned upon, but it's for a minute, but now it's hard. It's the, the ripped jeans, bro. Mm-hmm. They never been damaged and you. Wait a minute. That was all the 80s, 90s, and it's today. Yeah, mm-hmm. but. Because was, I was wearing ripped jeans. And we got oh, detention yeah. for that. Uh, yep. yep. Sure did. We now, got detention for Now you, I'll be looking at, like, when I was be taking my senior daughter, say, taking her to school, and be looking at all these, everybody wearing rib jeans. I'm like, wait a minute, you, you let your kid come to school like that? I mean, these little girls. And then you're thinking to yourself, like, wait, I used to. Why did I get, why did I get detention? detention? Why did I get detention for this? Starter like jackets. Oh, oh, that was a good one, too. That's a good one. That's a <laughs> You yes. know, you know, everybody had the Georgetown starter jacket. Oh yeah, you know, I didn't. They have never, they don't even know where Georgetown located, but you <laughs> had that big old boy. You know what? Because uh, we all saw it on uh, Boys in the Hood. Mm-hmm. Raiders so jackets. That and uh, oh, I got a story Georgetown for y'all. Shirt. I had a Georgetown shirt. I didn't even know who, who they were. Right. I didn't know where they were. Yeah, man, a quiet little I private thought... school up in the UP. I was gonna say, <laughs> man, I had, <laughs> I had, I had three Raider jackets. Oh, I, I know have, Raiders I had, was the villain. That was, but see, here's the thing: is it was only for the factor. It was like my cover up. But here's the thing: is I'm gonna apologize right now because if this was your vehicle, my bad. So I had my Raider jacket on, and I was actually breaking into cars and taking everything: radios, pause busters, all this other good stuff, CDs. When the CDs first came out. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so there was this huge man and we saw him pull up and he had a system in his vehicle mm-hmm. i'm like i'm getting that boy it wasn't the words i used okay good so he parked he went into the bar which was in a certain city and so i sat there waited till he went in i busted his window mm-hmm. on his driver's seat busted the window i hopped in the van <laughs> I could just with my Raiders jacket on. Mm. I hopped in the driver's seat, and the person that was with me said, click, he opens the door with me in the door. <laughs> and he goes, you didn't have to break the window. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I got up, I got up, and my, my Raider jacket was shredded oh, from the glass. Yeah. It was shredded. <laughs> I was like, oh. And I already had a buyer for the jacket. Mm. Damn. And I was like... And it was the eighties or the nineties. Just to the eighties. It was early eighties, nineties. I was a bad boy. Well, damn. Well, you know, they didn't have Geico apparently. <laughs> <laughs> no, hell no. With no Geico no, back then. Who had insurance in the eighties? No fucking body. Nobody. They had wrong plates. Dang. Yeah, yeah. That's that's yeah. you. I'm yeah. The uh, detached the, t- uh, the stereo systems. That shit was really that was, that, that's, uh, that's what was on there was an yeah. alpine with the three the six little glow in the dark buttons. Oh uh, yeah. Then you had the little lift, the little yep. little yeah. handle. Oh yeah. Push the button, you pull it. Gone. 
But he had he had this little console, the console, <laughs> the console. You open up the console and it was CD after CD. Oh, yeah. he was loaded up. He was loaded up, and it was it was he marked he marked them into like number one to what he liked. Oh know? wow! His playlist. Yeah, like a ranking. Oh, his playlist. Hey. So when I, I well, the funny part about it is when we actually got into getting the radio situated thing, and we actually pushed eject on on that radio. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Guess what popped out of that CD player? Vanilla Ice. I'm scared. Yeah, Miami Vice. Uh, oh. Soundtrack. Miami wow. Vice. So not wow. only did you break into somebody's car, you broke into somebody with OCD. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. With OCD, with the, you drove him crazy. He thought he was, what was that actor's name? The, uh, from Miami Vice? Oh, Don Johnson. Don Johnson. Yeah. He, that's the way he dressed, because it was a, a, a white oh. uh, privileged yeah. bar. Yeah. That's the only reason I broke in is because it was a privileged bar. Another one that um, Tito brought brought up was homies shirts. Oh, oh homies shirts. I used to collect those. The homie yeah, little I little. I had one. Oh, the little figurines. The little figurines. Oh yeah, I did have a bunch of those. I remember those little. Pepe, I had Pepe. Yeah. I, had I don't remember the names of them, but I do remember the little. Oh, Sarina. <laughs> Sarina was another little little oh, Chola so. girl. Oh yeah. Uh, I had a uh, I had a ninety one Chevy Lumina. And my dashboard had a bunch of them on it. I did that in my work van. I put the cholos in my work van. That's hilarious. Yeah, I remember that. When you said music, I thought about something. I'm like, oh, I will be a fool not to talk about music. But as but far as the 80s, 1983. Thriller. Fucking thriller. Mm-hmm. 32 million copies. Bro. Is that? Wow, just that year? That year or overall? By the, oh, end, wrong. By, the, to be by, by the end That's of probably in the billions by, now. by the end of eighty three, thirty two million yeah. copies. Like, wow, that's numbers. That's insane. That's speak volumes. Now think of that and how hard that would be to do now with downloads. Well, the people not, could not understand the language. Text. Yeah, that's true. If people could understand the music, there'd be there'd be more buyers. That's true. Mm-hmm. But you can't understand music today. Yeah. Back in the day. You, know, you knew what they were singing about. It's funny that you said it because Bone Thugs and Harmony back in the day, they we still listen to it. If you if you listen to Bone, then it's like, um, what the hell are they saying? I didn't know what the fuck they were saying. So it's like it was just one of those moments of good thing some uh, Elton. Okay, let's go with the eighties. You remember the tapes that had to pull out things? You had all the words. The lyrics. Oh, the lyrics. Yeah. yeah. Mm, the little lyrics. Fold, the fold-in lyrics. <laughs> yeah, the lyrics right inside. That you gotta open the cassette, take the cassette, and hold it. Right, you can see the lyrics. Every song has Oh, that's what he said. Oh, man, I don't know what he said. I had a um, a poison tape. Stop. With that one. Who let's, oh, what's it called? The, 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 who's got the cat dragon? Yeah. Yeah. Look at the cat dragon. Yeah. Yeah. Look at the cat dragon. Wow. I mean, I didn't buy it in the eighties, but I bought it later on. Like my 80s. first cassette, I, there's no lie, was Motley Crue, "Shout mm-hmm. of the Devil," mm-hmm. and then the second one was Luke Skywalker, which is, would be Two Life Crew." Two Life Crew. Mm-hmm. Luke Skywalker is the per- yeah. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. Wow. Midnight Star. What is Midnight Star? Midnight the group? group. I never heard of that one. But no. Oh, we can't. can't play. Oh, you can't. Oh, that's right. Never mind. Can I play on my phone? No. No, because it'll be in the show. Um, you, you actually, you, you, all you're doing is listening. So as long as it's not on air, it's it um, be. how sensitive is it? It's how sensitive. Oh, they'll, they'll pick it up. It'll pick it up. Well, then you have no rights to any music that's played that they hear. Mm. Not, not even that, unless I, re- unless it's like somebody, like for example, George Salazar's music. Yep. I can play his because, because he was here. He was here. Yeah. Well, I'm here. Play it. Yeah, <laughs> I'm the Midnight Star. Yo, that is a, right. We got Midnight Star. We got Midnight Star. We got Midnight Star. I came dressed up, you know, like you know, woo woo woo. Hey, hey, hey. This is my boy Midnight Star Lito. Midnight Star Lito. That ain't right. Oh my god. That we gotta be good in here. Right? We gonna we gonna take care of you, bro. No, we gotta take care. I had a, I had a moment where I posted a video on Facebook, and it had the radio playing in my car, and they blocked the, the, they muted it. Wow. On YouTube. So I was like, 
Correct. So I was like, whatever. They're too damn sensitive. Whatever, man. Well, it's not that they're, they're sensitive. sensitive. They have a policy. They have, because it's YouTube. It's not everybody else's tube. True. Well, how about, what about hairstyles, man? I got one of them. I did it for today, actually. This, this really long hair. He got his rock star. He got my rock star. He got his rock star. We got his linear hair. My linear <laughs> hair. Well, ben, ben, I didn't even ben, use Aquanet. Okay, yeah. Ben just went to the That's a lot of gel. Ben, I tell you what, that's a lot of gel. Ben just went to the barber shop, but before that, he had his mullet. Yeah. He did not have a mullet. No, he did. no, it was long though, but it wasn't like it was. It was. I can go like that. <laughs> you can do I can go like that. <laughs> 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 I remember, I missed the haircuts, man, uh, the Gumby haircuts. Oh, God. Well, that, uh, Bobby oh, Brown was the first yeah, one. Yeah. Bobby the Brown was the first one that had that little just yeah. the high top thing, like kid, uh, kid, play, kid like play. Kid, yep, kid, oh, kid oh, Eraser head. Okay. Yeah. Eraser head. Uh, I missed the uh, bowl haircut. Yeah, okay. the bowl. Oh, Where it was gosh. long on the top with Boy. it shaved on the bottom. Wow. Press bonus. Yeah, well, my mom Press bonus. Well, my cut my hair was bad. Dress Flores. Was that? Dress Flores. I, is that that stuff you put in your hair? Yeah. It, yeah it's, a really, hair really, it's a really, really thick Is that a green gel. bottle? It's a kind of a clear bottle with a green cap. Oh, yeah. But that's Tres, right. Tres Flores came yep. out in 1952. I used to use that in the 90s. And it smells so good. Oh, hell yeah, dude. Oh, my God. You can sit there. You know like what? Vicks. You can... Exactly. <laughs> I'm serious. For real. You can sit there and sniff it, it all day. I wonder if Amazon has that. Actually, you, um, Walmart carries it. Really? Yes. Oh, shit. Wow. Oh, wow. And I believe, if I'm not mistaken, I did see it at Walgreens. Remind me, I just oh, thought about, uh, he said it's like wax. That's it is. About, it uh, is. It's like wax. That's like black people. We had stuff called Murray's. Murray's, <laughs> coconut, and sheen. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, Dress Flores. I used to use it. Oh. <laughs> I didn't see. I didn't but he had sign it. language. I don't know if it was gang signs or sign language. Yeah. I don't know about you, man, from coming from Flint. But, uh, All right. Malik's so, throwing gang signs. But yeah, Tres Flores, I used to, my grandpa had it. Okay, yeah. And uh, then my cousin Steve had it. And then he introduced me to it. So I was like, man, this is actually pretty good. And, well, and actually, you know what? Like you that. didn't even need much. It's just a little tiny exactly. little dime drop. And, mm-hmm. just, and if you wanted more, add water. Mm-hmm. Put it oh, in, yeah, here. and you know what? No, where your hand mm-hmm. set is where it stuck. Yep, and that was it. Yeah, because I remember exactly that. Because I remember putting a little bit in my hand, going like that, and then I would just because we had, I had long hair back then, so I would put it in my hair and then just go like that. Yeah, and I'd be like, okay, let's go to school. <laughs> Shimmy it in right there. Yep, that stuff. That stuff. You know, it's cheap, but it works really well, yeah, and it's, it smells immaculate. Yeah, it's, I love that. It reminds me of my grandfather. I wonder how, yeah, exactly. That, that's exactly because yeah, it was it was it was old school. It was mm-hmm. all the Chicanos wore. You yeah, know what I mean? Exactly. All the Chicanos wore that, and it was just like back in the Cholo days or the, you know the Zoot Suiters. They all wore that. There it is. There it is right there. What? That's exactly the. See, that's the one right there. Oh, Walmart does it. I told you Walmart carry, but they carry the oil. Oh yeah. Oh, this is the other one. That's a gel. Yeah. Or the wax, whatever you want wax, to call it. Yeah. Man, that's not even that. Man, that's not that expensive. It smells great. And if anybody, well, there's, there's a, a shout out to Tres Flores. Go ahead and. Um, Tres Flores, go ahead and send it to you. Send it, send it. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. Black River Studios, look it up, Holland, Michigan. Don't I do want to give a shout out, though. I do want to give a, a special shout out to my little cousin, um, Christabel Silva. Happy birthday. That's I, didn't, your I didn't forget. Yes. Dude, Holland is, he... is my cousin. Yeah, that's true. Holland is my cousin. So he's she's the one that's married to Alex Silva. Alex, yes. Yep. I used to date Angie Silva. Okay. <laughs> Why? So yes. So happy birthday. Love you. Hope to see you soon. I think we. I think me and Chris Bell actually celebrated our birthday one year. That was oh her birthday's today. No, her birthday was yesterday, I believe. Oh, okay. Well, happy happy birthday. birthday. Belated birthday. Happy belated birthday. Um, yeah, so <clears throat> another thing that I was looking at for the 80s, uh, where'd it go? Uh, where'd it go? I just look at, uh, oh, TV shows. TV what? shows. Oh my God, what is that? Um, the little robot girl. Small Wonder. Small Wonder. <laughs> that was a creepy show, dude. That, that was creepy. Okay. Punky Brewster. Punky Brewster was another one. Elf. Oh, 
Kate, Kate, Willie, no problem. <laughs> but yeah, then we have facts of life, different facts strokes. Life, yeah. um, give me a break. Uh, all in the family, the Jefferson Silver Spoon. Silver Spoon. Yes, that's um, where uh, Alfonso made his first appearance. You know, it's funny because then he started doing Pepsi commercials with Michael Jackson. Yep, um, he did the um, Silver Spoons. I don't know if it's still on there, but it was on the Pluto app. It's still on there. Is it? Okay. Yep, it's still on there. Every single time I would go watch it. It was on the episode when um, he kept saying he knew Michael Jackson. Really? Yeah. And the only one I seen is every time I see, every time I watched it. Yeah. The dad came in on that train and went through the living room into the oh, kitchen yeah. and around yeah. into back into the living room. Mm-hmm. That's the episode I was going to. Yep. That was a. Um, but yeah, that that episode I was talking about was. Um, oh. They went to a, a diner because they said, "Oh," or he told all of his friends. Hey, I know Michael Jackson. He taught. I taught. Right. Some I remember moves that moves or something. Like that. I remember that. But then some Im- some fake Michael Jackson came yeah. in. Everybody thought it was really yeah. him. Yeah. And then of course something happened. I think like they got so excited they started taking his jacket off and they pulled a wig off or something like that. It that was wasn't a, really him, obviously. Um. What was another old one? Um. Another one was. Uh, oh, remember a different world. That's different. That was nineties. It was late eighty nine. Eighty nine. Eighty nine. I think it was. Remember when Bob Barker had black hair? Woo! Nope. Stop it. Mm-hmm. That was a different world. I think it might have been eighty. Ooh, what's your um? Say by the Bell was the nineties, wasn't oh, it? Damn, it was in the eighties. Nineteen eighty-seven and nineteen ninety-seven. Wow. Yeah, Say by the Bell started in eighty. What was her name? Turtle Lark. Oh, um, what was, what was her name? Lisa? Oh, on Saved by the Bell? Yeah, Lisa was Turtle or Lark. Oh, oh, oh Turtle Lark? was the show. <laughs> Lark Voorhees. Lark Voorhees. Yeah. Oh, I have summer. Lisa Turtle was her name on the show. Yeah. Got it. Uh, I had that mixed up. was from 89 to 93. There you go. Wait, what? Oh. Somebody died from the... Oh, speaking of mute, uh, TV shows, let's go to music. Shaba. Whatever Shaba. happened to Shaba? Shaba. Why does that sound familiar? He always came out with cassette tapes, and his cassette tapes were either gold, red, or blue. How do you spell it? Shaba. <laughs> S-H-A-B-B-A. Shaba! Oh, yeah, okay. Oh, that's 80s. Is that 80s? Oh, where did Shaba? Yeah, it was 80s, 90s. I believe it was more 80s. Oh, right here. He died in 1990. So. Huh. Uh, what was the other one? Uh, Too Short was 80s. Too Short, yep. Um, 80s, uh, R&B, I liked, um, well, I don't know if they were R&B, but the, the Jets. Uh, Lisa, Lisa, <laughs> Lisa, Nicole. Lisa, Lisa, Nicole, damn. Yep. Every time I hear those songs, wait, so you know some of the Segovias, then? Yeah, I know all the Segovias. All the Segovias. So you know Sylvia? Yeah. I work with her at Renison. Oh, really? Yeah. Tell her today. Uh, I'll see her tomorrow. Um, Sylvia, what up? Um, Hello, Sylvia. If you're listening. She's, yeah, I'm friends. She probably, she's probably at home chilling. Um, I think. Um, Holly Shore. I think Holly, Holly Shore, jeez. Uh, he was, uh, started in MTV, didn't he? Yep. As one of the hosts, co mm-hmm. host or something. Yep. And then he started making movies. Mm. Oh, yeah, probably sure. Yeah, I think he did. Actually. I think the best one he made was Encino Man. For sure. I didn't like. Um... No squeezing the ooze. <laughs> <laughs> Every time I. That ultra. That's it. Yeah. Oh, tequila. Ultra tequila. Ultra. Yeah. <laughs> that was a good. That was the, probably the best one he's done. I didn't like the one where he. Uh, Oh, incredible! No, that was in the seventies. I'm saying incredible. What about eighteen? Eighteen, yes. That's another thing. airwolf. Yep, airwolf. Um, of course, classic Smurfs. Oh, the Smurfs! Jeez, uh, <coughs> Chippendale. Oh, oh, remember? Hey, <coughs> Chippendale. Chippendale. Um, what's the other one? Um, well, what Malik said was um, Howard the Duck. Howard the Duck. 
actually got that on DVD. Well, Beavis and Butthead. Beavis, uh, Beavis and Butthead, yep, they were. I think that's when, um, let's see, 80, not 88, 89 is when Texas Ranger first came out. Oh, yeah, Texas Rangers. Yep. With Chuck Norris? Chuck Norris, yep. Um, another show uh, that I was thinking of was um, Helping in the Chipmunks. I don't know. The funny thing was, is as we grow older, um, I think to myself, how in the hell did, that, did they make that work? Helping in the Chipmunks. I mean, to me, it's like, the guy who had the three chipmunks as pets, one was fat, one was smart, and the other one just got in trouble all the time. Yeah. It's exactly who our kids are. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. We have, if we have three kids, that's exactly how it would be. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And it's like, okay, well, they all can sing, so let's form a band. And then that's what happened. And you got the Brady Bunch. Brady Bunch? Yeah. <laughs> mm-hmm. Well, the Brady Bunch came out, what, in the 70s? I think they rocked off in the 80s. I think, yeah, I think it. Breakfast Club. Dude, come on. I was, I was, I was, I was that guy. Oh, the stoner, the, yeah. um, the metalhead. The hell was his name? I, you know, it's one of those things where you think of it, you think of it, and, uh, and you forget their names. Uh, John Bender. John Bender. He's a pack of smokes. You know, <clears throat> that movie is one of those movies that never gets old. No never. matter how many times you You, you cannot, because it clarifies who people are in personality as well as characteristics. It, in even, even, in, even in today's world, mm-hmm. we are still those same people, and the people there yeah. today are in, they're in the same category. It's, yeah, you it's, got the rich people. Too. You got the you know people who love sports. You got the people mm-hmm. who are just drugged out, or you got the people who are smart and just going to stay to themselves. Exactly. It's the same people, it's just in different era. Mm-hmm. So let me... that really worked really well too, man. Because it's it's. I tell you what, chips, chips. Ah, Rachel says, Rachel, uh, the littles, the littles, the little munchies. The littles. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I remember those ones. Uh, Rachel who? Rachel Hall. Oh, uh, hi Rachel. How you doing, Prima? Uh, let's see. Magnum PI. Magnum PI. Jeez. Naomi Sanchez. Says that whole Eduardo's. look. That whole look from Magnum PI. That is such pedophile look. Uh, let's look it was like a seventies, a seventies porn to eighties. Father, it, it was crazy. Just the look of. <laughs> mm-hmm. No, you got to get the whole image. Tom Selleck was his name. Tom Selleck, yeah. You know he had the Hawaiian shirt, white shorts. Dockers. Kind of like that. That wasn't it. That is not it. Definitely not it. That looks like a. Oh, that's just a drawing. It looks like a video. Oh, that's a video game. Hold on. Uh, that's not it either. Oh, picture. Oh, yeah. see. Right here. Kind of like that? Yeah. <laughs> that, that's just pedophile status, bro. Yeah, it is. Look at, I mean, the short. You're lucky that wasn't Epstein's yard. <laughs> Epstein's I that's, that's, Sorry, guys. I, I, mean, I just mean, threw that out there. My bad. No, that's okay. We're, we're, I've seen that list though. Yeah, that list was just horrible. Uh, it's horrible. The island list. The yeah the. Whew, I tell you what. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Knight Rider. Knight Rider. Yes. Yep. Oh, and I got some new hats. Oh, nice. Like that. And then my Bulls one. Oh, that's a good color. I like that color. Good to have him in the background. Hello, everybody. But, um, yeah, that's another good show. Dukes of Hazzard. Well, Dukes of Hazzard on the set. Was Dukes of Hazzard in the 80s? Yes, it was. Oh. Um, Actually, it was part 70s, 80s. Then you got the Bandit. Mm-hmm. Oh, what, was yeah. it, what was it called? The, Smoking um, the Bandit. Smoking the Bandit, yeah. yeah. I think that was like late 70s, early 80s. 
Could be mistaken. There it is. I remember watching that show and I remember watching that show and uh, wanting that car. Look how beautiful it is. I know. Green Acres. No, that was a 60s show, wasn't it? 60s, 80s, 70s? Yeah, Green Acres. Was Partridge Family, that was 70s. Benson's. Benson. Oh, my God, Benson, the, the butler. Bo Blue. Welcome Hello. back. To the bottom of the map. Welcome back to the show. Malik is back, everybody. Say hi to Malik. All right, what up? Back you feel so better, about. Malik. You're doing that, Mal- that, that 80s deal? Yeah. You know, $75 really for that ball. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. How did we forget the Wonder Years? The Wonder Years. Oh. Penny. Why did my shoulder just start? And Kev, what's his name, Kevin? Kevin, Kevin Savage. Uh, some Savage name. Ben Savage. Ben no, Savage. Fred Savage. Fred Savage. Fred Savage is the older one. Okay. Ben Savage was Ben, the Savage. ben Savage was the one that was on um, <sighs> Boy Meets World. Yes, you're right. Uh, so we got the Waltons. Um, Waltons was seventies or late seventies. I think. Of, yeah. Little Hawks in the so, Prairie. Little Hawks in the Prairie, Prairie, but that was in the seventies as well. Seventies, eighties. I, I remember seeing thinking about Little Hawks in the Prairie. There was this one. You liked Laura, didn't you? Oh, you were in the bathroom, weren't you? Major. Every Were you time. watching Laura the whole time? Between Laura with the buck teeth. I don't put y'all business out there. Don't you, put go ahead, put my business out there. What you know about me? Did there. you make Laura call you Pa? Oh! <laughs> <laughs> yes, master. Let's <laughs> <laughs> switch the roles. Yes, master. This one episode where uh, the, daughter, <laughs> the daughter wanted to go to the town den, the town shindig, mm-hmm. and uh, She's like, Ma, I seen a dress that I want for the dress. She's like, Oh, really? She's like, Well, how much is it? She was like, It's two dollars. She was two dollars. She was like, Two dollars? Honey, we don't have that kind of money. I'm like, What do you mean? What's your cash app? I'll cash you back to the 1820s. I'll send you that's two silvers. But it just. That was two silvers back in the day. What was that? What was that based off of? 19 something? Early 1900s? Based on oh, 1890s. 1890s? Yeah, I think. So, just the thing, what, two bucks in the 1890s is what? That was like 200 bucks. It had to be. That's, no, that's, that's 70 bucks right now. 70 bucks? Yeah, $69.60. Damn, that's crazy. So, man, that was a, that was a $70 dress back then. <laughs> You know, yeah, I, just, I, just, I don't know. I was thinking about this. I don't even know if I spend seventy dollars out. Right, you know, right. hey daughter, you, you need a dress. I ain't spending seventy dollars. Right, you better go to Walmart. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense when you yeah, think you about it. Grab his dress. I'm gonna get this eight ball. I don't know. What it's <laughs> <laughs> so, so do. <laughs> I'm five dollars shy, but hey, you, but, you better make your decision right now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm mentioning. Why are you making me do that? I'm mentioning like his beard. Yeah, yeah, he on his way. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, that is true because if you actually think about it, we'd be the same way. Be like, yeah, uh, we I'm not spending sixty dollars on that. Well, wait, wait, we got to go back because of the factor of back in the day of the eighties. I already told you where I came from. They're still in the eighties. Mm. Oh, right, yeah, that's true. I came from Oklahoma, where the where the where the city is still in the eighties. Mm. In the eighties, was I'm, I'm not talking. I'm talking. This kid came in, and I already told you guys a story, but I'm gonna let them know. Mm-hmm. It was it was funny because it was a mixture of gangs and and, and, and respect. Mm-hmm. So this kid, fourteen years old, comes in riding a horse, and he and he's you know he talks to my aunt and says, "I'm I'm going to the store, ma'am. Would you like something? I have four saddles, so I have something to you know I can put your stuff in there." Mm-hmm. She gives him money. He goes to the store, buys what she wanted, puts it in the saddle. Goes to her house, hands her the stuff. She gives him a tip. He takes off, which his stable for the horse was across the street from my aunt's property. Right. Now, everybody knows my aunt has big property. <clears throat> so he goes across the way, puts the horse away, goes inside. All of a sudden, you see him with a bandana. Holding the beard. He's, he's hood. Yeah. Respect. He's hood. He showed respect. He showed respect. First respect. is respect for his elders. Then it was who he is. Yes, yeah. sir. 
See, and it's just like, wait a minute, what happened? That's the difference right. of my miss from the 80s. Is oh, yeah. What? Yeah, respect it, for your elders, man. And remember, it was, she didn't even know her. You know what I mean? Yeah. It was just like, how how is it that we down down in the South, they showed respect first? It yeah. wasn't, if you respect me, I respect you. It was, I, I'm showing you respect. That was what i know known from Holland back in the day oh, yeah. from the 80s. And this was is, showing respect. It didn't matter if it was it, your elder or not. You showed respect. Even how they view yeah. the, age, no, even they the young guys and young kids don't even understand, like, what age really is. Like, I say that meaning, like, uh, it, it's nothing for a, a, a 18, 19, 20-year-old to call a 30-year-old, which is only, you know, 12 years old, older than them. You know, man... Super old. Who the heck? What you talking about? So that, I'm at an open gym. I'm at an open gym one day. I'm we hooping, and one of the young kids who was like, he was playing peace out there. All right, man, good game, good game. All right, man, we will holler at you, man. He was like, all right, OG, I holler at y'all. Who, who are you talking to? Man, who the hell is you talking to? You call me OG? <laughs> you want a girlfriend at your age? If you don't stop. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Like, they, yeah, they're like, man, wait, wait, hold on. You said you had girlfriends this I got, I got girlfriends. Wait, wait, call an argument. We're 20 years old. Oh, all right. Woo, you kind of scared me, nigga. I didn't know you were going with this. 20 years old? No, man. <laughs> Where you were going with this? No, nah, bro. No, I'm just saying, I, was, I, I didn't, but, well, I didn't, but. <laughs> <laughs> can't consider her uh, girlfriend, but yeah. Yeah, she was 21. She's your girl and she's your God friend. God damn it, she was 21. She showed me the ID and she went to the club. Oh, my God, the 80s. But repeat. Let's not repeat this. And I'm only going to say it because it's part of the '80s. If she's old enough to bleed, she's old enough to succeed. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, you know yeah, what yeah, yeah, that yeah, was what I'm saying. So sick. That was so sick. But we didn't. We thought it was funny back in the day. It was a pure innocent joke to where now everybody would get offended. Right. '80s people were tough. People we didn't care who. We would talk our smack. We'd be sarcastic and. Be, ah, Nowadays, like, oh my god, I'm so offended. Right. Mm. Yeah, it's it's different, man. Um, yeah, like you say, you said they used to uh, you said they used to walk your groceries to your car and load them in, up for you uh, back then. Boom. And what happened? Yeah, to, what? That just made me think about what happened to full Family service, fair used full to do service that. gas stations, bro. They stopped because people were putting in the wrong chemicals in the vehicle. Oh, yeah. because you know, we started hiring all these dumb kids that wanted a job but didn't want to do the job but just hurry up and did it. And they instead, of, you know, instead of putting oil, yeah. they put they put water inside something that they weren't supposed oh. to put water in, and they didn't know what yeah. was what. And, and they so like, stop that. Keep in the eighty-seven. It is yeah. right. And so, yeah, exactly. and even then, exactly. air in the tires, thirty-five pounds per tire. But back in the day, it was forty-five because the yeah. tires were bigger. Oh, right. yeah. But they were over putting over air in the tires, so they stopped mm-hmm. letting guys put in air because nobody had a gauge back in the day. It was kick the tire, and it was good. Yeah. So you'll inflate it and it explodes. Once you right. pop. Wow, yeah, yeah that's exactly. Sure. Yeah, that's an explosion for sure over inflation. Especially a, a 45 pound tire. Trust me, have you ever heard one of them explode? Uh, as loud as hell. No. I heard a bike one, ex- a tire. You'll see this? Uh, 10 times uh, tire. Oh, yeah, I'm sure. It was, yeah. you know, it's funny because I remember my bike. I had a, I don't remember what kind it was, but I remember my bike was sitting in the front, front porch and I had just aired it up. And then I went inside and came back out. And I looked down, and I was getting ready to ride my bike, and I looked back, and I was like, what the fuck? So I, it had a hole, and the tube was coming out. It was <laughs> aired up. <laughs> so it's kind of like the women that I used to deal with, man. Now they got big mouths, they're loud. Yeah. I'm sorry, ladies, I'm playing. It's a joke. Um, it's just so a podcast. I rubbed the, the tube. <laughs> I had to pause it. thing that came out, mm-hmm. and it exploded. Man, that, that was so freaking loud. Wow. It scared the crap out of me. <laughs> Here's a memory. Back in the, here's a memory back in the eighties. Mm-hmm. It was me, my brother, and one of our friends. I ain't gonna name him because he is on right now, and he'll remember and start probably laughing and be like, "You're a butthead." <laughs> it was ten o'clock at night. We snuck out of my house, my well, my parents' house. We were yeah. young. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I don't know what possessed them to go, hey, let's go to Wesco. Oh, so you lived on the north side. Yeah, I lived on the north side. Yeah. So we 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 took our bikes, we rode them all to Wesco, and they're like, and, they, and, and back in the day is when, you know, you had your sodas, you had chips and everything oh, yeah. sitting outside. Mm-hmm. Right? 
And so they were like, oh, yeah, how are we going to steal this? They didn't even know we pulled up. You know, we're on our, our bikes, BMX bikes. Yeah. <laughs> Next thing you know, they're like, well, go inside and make an application. Say you want a job. Oh, the distraction. <laughs> this, did you hear what I just said? They wanted distractions so they could steal, but they want me to put an application in. Oh, yeah. <laughs> What's on an application? That makes no sense. Your name, your phone, your address, number, your phone your... number. Exactly. Social security you know, number. They just yep. went far enough to put a fake in. I wouldn't know what they were doing. They, exactly. they, they, just, they tagged me along. I was, I was a little brother. I, do want yeah. I was a little brother. And yeah. I listened to... Yeah. I wanted yeah, to be cool. Telling, yeah. That's hilarious. Trying to be so cool. I go into the gas station and I put an app and they're looking at me like, you what, 12, 13 years old? And you want, a and you want an application? Okay, yeah, here you go. Here, okay. fill it out. I'm just saying, yeah. just call me in three years. Yeah. <laughs> so anyway, by the time we even get to our house, mm-hmm. there are five cop cars sitting there waiting for us. Oh, there's was waiting. Mm. That is deep. And here's, <laughs> and I, I, I kid, kid you not, here's my brother <laughs> carrying two liters. While riding a bike up to the car. Wow. Not realizing. Here's his friend carrying Mountain friends. Dew up to the car. Wow. Not realizing they were there for them. And not realizing that hey, they told me to put an application in for a job which had all everything, all my details in there. Wow. Of where I lived. That's crazy. That's the dumbest that's, criminal. That needs to be on the dumb. dumbest it criminals. Does. It does. I swear. <laughs> and being twelve, thirteen, it wasn't really much of what you know, I was thinking, I was just trying to hang out with my brother and trying to hang out with, you know, older people than me. Yeah. And it was like... It's funny you say that. Man, I tell you what. Damn. I have, a, I have a story similar to that. Um, when Walgreens was on 16th Street. Yep. Where, okay. So we lived, we grew up on Central between 19th and 18th. And uh, me and my brother, I'm not going to say which one because he's probably watching. I saw him post something already. Uh decided to walk to Walgreens and as we're standing in the candy aisle I said, because I, I noticed the lady walking past so I said hurry up and get something so we can leave and so finally about 10 minutes later the lady no comes rush. in the aisle yeah, no rush but uh, she comes in the aisle and I didn't realize my brother had already stuck something in his pocket and huh? oh, I thought it was on me <laughs> Anyways, I know I'm looking right at it. <laughs> Anyways, so. How old was this girl? And who would you look at? I know, right? You yeah. didn't even think he was looking at the wrong thing. <laughs> anyway. So, so you blame your brother for putting stuff in your pocket. No. What well, happened was is <laughs> she comes up to us and she goes, do you want to uh, tell me what you guys are doing? And my brother goes, oh, never mind. I don't want it. Puts it back on the fucking shelf. And I didn't take anything yet, so I didn't get in trouble. Mm. But you're so, an accomplice. Right. So they take both of us in the office, and she said, you can either I can either call the cops or you guys can get banned from the store. Which one is it? And we're like, we'll take banned. We'll, we'll take, yeah, we'll be banned. We'll take banned. So they called our mom. They See, called I would have said call the cops, and I would have ran. I mean. Because then they can't ban you. That's true. Because then you're. You know, I'm not I saying think, they're not going to watch you every time you walk in, but yeah, that's true. But I don't think they had cam- well, they probably had cameras back then. But well, they had uh, that one person going like this. What up, John? Yeah, <laughs> he's not the one that has caught us. Uh, he's like with binoculars, I see him in all five. What up, John? Um, John Ortiz. Oh, my buddy, what's up, Johnny John? John, uh, I used to play in the band with him. Oh yeah, with George and other. Actually, John is actually a really, he's a really good artist. Yeah, he's, he is Great. Good. Oh, my I God. Did not, dude. How did I not remember All him and his brothers, man. Holy jeez. Yeah, they're good. Um, I remember uh, back in the 80s. Hey, let's talk about the 80s. 80s. They were those the 80s, guys. Uh, the Suave Band. Suave Band. That's who they were back in the day. Oh, that sounds familiar. That was uh, all the Ortheses and Brian mm-hmm. Martinez. Brian Martinez. Uh, so him and Michael are this Martinez? Uh Actually, I don't think... No, that was my cousin, Michael Martinez. I'm talking Brian Martinez. Oh, okay. I don't know that. Um, he was a... They called him Chewbacca back in the day. Mike Simpson? I, mean, I don't know. I probably had to see him. Wait. I'm thinking of Mike... Why do I keep... Every time I think of that, I think of Michael Martinez. Because they've got the same last name? I mean, because it's... In, I, mean, I don't know, because that's the only one I met. 
What the what the Escorpion. Scorpion. Escorpion. Um but yeah, they uh so anyways they called our mom and they said you eat it we were banned from the store. And years later, when it was still Walgreens, I reminded myself about that. <laughs> and I went in there and I walked past that aisle. Did you look like, for your picture on the wall? No. Oh, you know what? Never mind. No, it wasn't there. <laughs> <laughs> 30 years later, your picture still on the wall. <laughs> Even if it's Family Dollar. I'm just kidding. Right. <laughs> it's still in the office. <laughs> I remember one time I went to Columbia store, um, probably early 2000s. Probably about two thousand two. No, no, it was a it was a nineties. So I went in there to, and and I, remember when you would walk in and the counter was on the left side. Yes. Columbia, yes. And that other side had video mm-hmm. tapes and stuff. Mm-hmm. Yep. Movies and shit. Oh yeah. So the I movie, walked in. The porn in the back. Yeah. Oh yeah. Then that. Yeah. The, yeah. It was, you know, the spanky area. Yep. <laughs> so I remember. Every time you try sneaking in, you hear those beats. <laughs> no. Oh, yeah. You, you 18? Yeah. Right. right. Yeah. Before you come out and try to peek around and see, make sure ain't nobody else there. Right. <laughs> Somebody you know. <laughs> Same thing with Family Dollar. Right. Oh, I mean, uh, not Family Dollar. Put on, put on those techniques, Benji. Family, binge-y. family video. video. The Benji movie. They had those uh, western doors, those little swing doors. Yeah, family, family video. video. Right. And you always kind of looked out to make sure you weren't seeing nobody. Yeah. <laughs> Somebody that Somebody that knows Somebody you. Know you know knew what you're you. doing in there. Oh, hot pastor. All the nasty yeah. tapes to be all bright in color, though. Right, blue and red. And she, so, I don't know what that, know what that is. She had that purple one. All right. So, yeah, I saw... Red uh, and purple. I, was, I went to go pay for my stuff, and I looked... You know, I'm just looking around, waiting for her to bring stuff. And I looked, and I was like, what the frick? There was a picture of um, one of my... my parents. Oh. Oh. And so... I didn't want to say it out loud. Say it louder. No. No. Nobody's listening. Yeah. So, <laughs> there was a... I was like, I don't know what happened, but... You know, it's, uh, it's funny because I, I I, never thought I would see that. It's like, did you ever walk in a place like that and, and see a relative's picture up? No. Or, or name? I only went to jail with pictures up. I, well, I oh, seen okay. my... <laughs> I seen my cousin with pictures up. I seen my cousin who was missing. You know, seen her on the wall at Walmart as one of the missing kids. Bro. Oh, really? Oh, that, was, that had to be that, that, that had that, to be a shocker. That was deep. That's like crazy. we knew she was missing. Yeah, it was but like it was just to actually see it. Did actually see like dang, she It kind of hit like, the heart. Oh, I was just gonna say that reality hit. About that Did you have to find her? Bro, found her. So on a fluke. What? A guy from living in Holland, originally from Chicago, mm-hmm. went to Chicago just to go back home and visit and seen her. Bro. Stop. He's seen her in big ass. He, ain't you from Holland? He was like, hey, yeah. shorty, I think I know you. You you should stay in Holland. She was like, yeah, why? So oh, like, they looking for you. He came and called and said, hey, man, we, I stabbed a little girl that I'm looking for. She right now here, bro. Wow. That I could she done took out with a man. An yeah. uh, older man. Oh, damn. Yeah, the dude. That was, that, was, that was the 80s, though. She was like 19. And he was like 46. But see, that's, see, back in the day, it was the, you know, the younger Women went with older men. Oh, okay. I remember some of. Mm-hmm. If you're all listening, I'm sorry. I'm no, going to post. air you out. Just yeah. post about it. But had some of my cousins went out with older men mm. because it was stability. Stability. Yeah, it was exactly. a yep. father figure. Yep. It was because yep. they had father issues. Yeah, they had daddy yep. issues. They did daddy mm-hmm. issues. So and they got the like, of a world. Daddy and Zaddy. Daddy. Daddy. <laughs> daddy and Zaddy. Hey, Poppy. With the D and the C. <laughs> the Zaddy. Zaddy. <laughs> but yeah, so, I mean, that actually had, you know, I don't even know if that, that does, because I don't even pay attention to today's world, but back hey, in the day, dude. that's what it was. It's, 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 a lot, it's going on this day. I trust me, y'all. I was looking at a... Uh... That, okay, now that you said that. Okay, when I lived in... Well, real quick. Yeah, when I lived in Kentucky, I was working at a place called... Um, your mama they made lo- they made like a uh, office mama's furniture. Sister. Your mama's sister? This is no. a convenience store. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the right. convenience store. Yeah, I was going to out to uh, my old grandpa. We yeah. that. <laughs> no, I worked at a uh, factory. Uh, Uplick, I think it was called furniture or something like that. Anyway. So <laughs> that kind of freaks out with public furniture. Yeah. <laughs> with Onyx. <honest. laughs> What's on the public furniture? I know. But anyway, they made all. Like, it was your sister, auntie's cousin's dad, right? Exactly. Something smelly. Something smelly. No, but uh, 
Because you said about women dating you know, older men. Older men. Yeah. So this lady started working about the same time I did, and we you know became friends and started chatting or whatever. And she at at the time I was like early twenties, and she was in her forties and already had like three kids. Mm. And so she kept asking me out to go on a date. Hey, you want to go out to eat? You want to go go to a movie? Whatever. I was like, yes. <laughs> so finally did. I mean, we never had sex or anything. But uh, did you even know what that was back in the day? No, I didn't. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I think no, I was twelve. I was twelve uh, at the time. No, I'm just kidding. See, I was twelve when <laughs> I. She got to do some late bloomers. <laughs> so you were ten? Right, right. Damn, yeah. you were ten. I was ten. Yeah. No, that's no, called rape. Yeah. <laughs> 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 oh my yeah. gosh. So what Malik, tell us about that horrible story. So oh. yeah. Uh, so back to Flint. <laughs> <laughs> it was Boy Scouts of '85. Oh. oh. Cougars. <laughs> Was it at was awkward. I'm like, there's no other people on the camping trip with us? <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean, pitch a tent? What is pitch a tent? Why do we have to share a sleeping bag? Yeah. You didn't bring your own sleeping bag? I think you brought a stick in here. <laughs> Why is that stick growing? Do you have grapes? <laughs> oh, your beard is scratching me. <laughs> your beard is itchy. Your, your beard is oh. itchy. <laughs> Uh, good one. Thanks, Malik. Where's the thing when you need them? <laughs> Inside of my thighs are itching. <laughs> you had your press? Okay. That's, so, uh, all right. So, uh, let's let's, so let's let me know. Right, you guys are you guys gotta be going. Yeah, but I was thinking, I was looking at uh major events from the eighties. You know what I'm saying? Like oh, world yes. change events, like. So I'll just run through the list real quick. Then the like, Met so one, right? The you got World a, Series? The assassination on Reagan and Pope John Paul. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, that was, uh, what year was that? That was 81. Mm. Yep, March of 81. Uh, Pope John Paul um, in where, uh, the, uh, the Berlin Wall. The Berlin Wall. Oh, Berlin Wall, Berlin yeah. Wall. The East to West. Yep. Uh, I actually had a friend in fifth grade. Where her dad was over there when they tore it down. I know a band that sang about that wall. A what? A band? A band. Scorpions. Yes. Yes. The Beirut Beirut Barracks of Bombings. I forgot Mm -hmm. about that. Wasn't the uh, Bermuda Triangle part of that in the 80s where there was just Mm -hmm. a lot of stuff missing in the 80s? Still still happening. They stopped going after that. (laughs) They finally got the point. You know, I think we should go to... Scenic route. Go around. Go around. Go to the South Pole back around. Because <laughs> I don't even know where that shit is. <laughs> uh, well, you're right. And then, uh, it's a triangle, so we'll go around. That, that Challenger crash. Oh, the Challenger, that. Challenger crash. I was that just going to say that. Bro. And, uh, January 20th you know, coming up. It's crazy because I was watching a video. We were in class when they pulled in. Exactly. They pulled in a cart. <laughs> yeah. With a square big old box mm-hmm. TV. Yep. They turn it clink. I, wait, year, little, wait, does it say what year that was? 86. Okay, so 86, I, was, January 28th. I was seven years old, so I was probably what? Second grade, first or second? That's second grade. Yeah. Well, yeah, I remember that. And they were pulled in that little cart and they had the TV. Mm-hmm. And yeah, everybody stopped that. school, everybody stopped work, and everybody mm-hmm. was just watching Focused that. Focused on that. That was, you know, and it's crazy because I, I, I watched a video that somebody actually recorded that there at, really? in Florida, like an old video they found. Yeah. And everybody, it is. Oh man, it was like creepy. It was like dead silence. So like, everybody just sit, it, bro. Yeah, everybody in that video was cool. like all excited. Kind of sounds like a man. And, <laughs> all right. Yeah, <laughs> seventy-three no seconds. No, 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 she left. Where she left? Right. <laughs> seventy-three seconds. And you explode. And the guy. Here's what creepy. Here's the creepy part about that. The the, the guy that was recording it uh, said because the lady, you could hear somebody talking in the background. She goes, something's going on. It's like, what, what happened? What's, why is that white smoke up there? And the guy recording, he goes, I don't know, but... He hit the firmament. You know, the what? That's exactly what happened. What, what, what the firmament. The firmament. The, the globe, the glass that protects us. Yeah, the, the shield. The shield that, of the world. That's that real? I never realized that. Yeah, that's I'm dumb. 
Hey, okay. everybody, I'm stupid. Oh, right. that's why it's in the Bible. That's why they didn't, that's oh. why they landed on the moon. There ain't no damn landing. Right. Moon landing. The, the moon landing was at Universal Studios, bro. Yep. I guarantee Hold you. On. Cool. Right. Let's back up. In a, in a pool. Back it up. Lot number seven. <laughs> 71. And 71. Here's okay. where Friends was filmed. Right. <laughs> You ain't right. That's, you, you, know, you ain't right. After different strokes. <laughs> we got the move, man. The First preach took it. A, a oh, man. <laughs> Even Oh, you know, that's funny you said that because when we went to Univer- or, uh, uh, NBC Studios, yeah. we were doing the tour and they were telling us what shows filmed in the studio. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, Saved by the Bell and Fresh Prince were in the same spot. Oh, wow. Um, uh, that's Friends. why Will Smith acted white. Yeah, that's it. He weird ass. What? He may, he, may, he <laughs> act more than that. But, uh, oh, stop it. Man, we ain't going to get into that. Oh, Chris uh, Rock, yeah. Wait, what are you guys talking about? <laughs> Let it go. You know, just keep it down again. Um, <laughs> yeah, right. Uh, so back to the list. Yeah, yeah, like, well, honestly, then I was this stupid thing kicked on and I couldn't hear it. Oh, okay. That's, 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 that's what it was. You know what? I had to turn my hearing aids down. Boop, boop, boop. You got to turn them up. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> right. See, that's the problem. You go the opposite way. You know, <laughs> back in the day, they had these little tubes that came out like a little horn. And they would, wherever they wanted they to listen to, they would actually move. Wow. I think you need to do that with your hearing aids. It's kind of moving well, your hearing where you want to listen. On my phone, though. Yeah, you gotta yeah, let me go ahead and turn that up. <laughs> just, just put up. Malik, and it, it'll go right to Malik's right. voice. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what up, bro? <laughs> so, and then, so in uh, 1981, that was those, those uh, Iran raid released all those hostages. Oh, that's right. They held them for 444 days. Oh, yeah. And they captured them that. November 4th of 79 and let them go January 20th of 81. Oh, that's coming up. The anniversary up, of that. The anniversary of that, bro. Wow. Um, this is the with John Lennon, assassin. John Lennon was assassin. Yep. Yep. Oh, yeah. I just... Wait, what date was it? Because his birthday's coming up, I think. Uh, he was assassinated on December 8th. This is his birthday in January. 1980. Yeah. John, John Lennon's birthday. I thought it was. In January, January 26th, was it? I think so. He was assassinated on December 8th, 1980. That's his, uh, well, that's when he was assassinated. From Durain's fan. Crazy Durain. Oh, wait. No, we were way off. His birthday in October. October. Who's in January? Who's January 26th? One of the Beatles, wasn't it? Star? Um, Ringo Star? Uh, wow, I'm old. You know, I know the, no- the names of the Beatles. I knew who he was. Mm-hmm. No, he's uh, July, July 7th. I know some. Who's July? Who's January 26th? Uh, the, uh, Paul McCartney. Al Capone. Al Capone. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that was by 1940s. Yeah. Al, Al Capone's bar mitzvah. Oh, never mind. I thought Paul McCartney. Not Paul McCartney. What's that other guy's name? Ringo Starr. 1980. What's, um, the Olympic boycotts in Moscow. Paul McCartney. Oh, yeah. Pan Am Flight 103. Yep. yep. Explodes in Scotland. Who was the other one? He did a... Paul uh, Ringo. Two hundred fifty-nine people, in a, oh, and they killed eleven people on the ground. Jeez. Wall Street crash, and I think George Harris. George Harris. On June fifth, nineteen eighty-one, America identified AIDS. Mm. That's right. Uh, you were close. Uh, February twenty-fifth. Twenty-fifth. Yep. He was so I knew one of the Beatles had the January birthday. No, his was February twenty-fifth. No, I'll see January and February. June 5th, 1981. Oh. Anyway, the U.S. Center for Control <laughs> Intervention released a first official report on what will become known in the world as the AIDS pandemic. After five gay men were identified as having some rare kind of pneumonia. Like, wow. Hmm. We are the world. And, yeah, we are the exactly. Let's so, the virus. when that song came out, did you really think they were going to cure AIDS? No, I'm just kidding. No, but they raised a whole lot of money. Hell for yeah, they did. They, the American, or not. The they got a, they, they have a cure. I, I, they I had a cure. They have a cure. <laughs> There's got to be. I don't have a cure. They wait did, for enough people to get sick and then. You cannot create something and not have, a, exactly. and not have a, a cure for it. Well, I mean. COVID. A, a prime example. Magic Johnson, he got the cure. Yep. That's you got to pay for it. Very you got to pay, you gotta, pay you gotta, the piper in order to get healed. That is so 100% true. Because you want to pay for it, he had it, and now all of a sudden he's fine. He ain't got it. 
Oh. Him or his wife ain't got it. Exactly. And I'm pretty sure his son probably... But you got to remember, back no, son got it son. mentally. Yeah. <laughs> You ain't right. You ain't right. You're not right. You got brain, right. Right. <laughs> he got brain aids. Brains. He is out there. He's got brains. <laughs> right. Brains. He has lost brains. his brain. <laughs> brains. He got brains. Brain aids. So he, it's just messed up. I just, uh, you know, I don't want to be, get too off subject, but just thinking about that situation with his son, like, how do you be around an alpha male like that? Mm. Uh, Your MVP of the NBA, NBA champion, Hall of Famer. Billionaire, and you decide that well, you know what? I'm gonna go over to these Paul seminar classes. And <laughs> yeah, wow, can you, can you, you got a word. Yeah, can you sign <laughs> up work at yeah, the RuPaul workshop, Dad? <laughs> like, yeah, I'm gonna say something about that. <clears throat> Uh, and I'm dead serious about this because I'm, oh, tired. I'm so right. tired. Everybody, be quiet. He's yeah, dead serious. I'm dead serious. Don't hurt, <laughs> don't hurt nobody. I'm 100%. No. Anyway, um, I, 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 huh? <laughs> I just, I just want to say that I don't, I don't understand why they have to be on TV. Bro. So, watching some, watching TV with my son last night. Rupaul's show. Tonight, we at first of the uh, medicine commercial come on, mm-hmm. come on. Uh, whatever the name of the matter, the Zulu Babu. Yeah, this cannot be, and uh, you, and this not help with the transmission of AIDS. And all that. like, and it's two obviously gay dudes just mm-hmm. all hugged up and cuddling and kissing. I'm not here. I'm not telling my son. I'm not like, back the, on the lake. Yeah. yeah, and my son's mm-hmm. like, you damn it. Like, oh yeah, it doesn't stop AIDS. It prevents. I turn. It. Yeah, he's there. I turn. I'm talking about. So. That very next show, I turn go to MTV because we like to watch ridiculousness. That show, yeah, we turn it out and it's boom. RuPaul drag queen race. RuPaul coming up. <laughs> Billy go back <laughs> queen. Oh my god! <laughs> what in the physical? So, let's 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 go with this. The I commercials. That. We were talking the other day, me and you, Malik. Yeah, we were talking about the commercials of when I was in New Mexico and mm-hmm. I had to go out there and do some ministry work. Mm-hmm. The commercial I heard. <laughs> oh my goodness! The commercial I heard was a it was a vaginal cream commercial, and the daughter comes in and the mom says, oh, "Honey, I know you are fast, girl, but go take a shower and put this on. Yeah, it'll cover up the smell." Wow, that is. Did I just and it, it, you got you got me and you have three other pastors in this vehicle and we're listening to the radio station? Oh, it was on the radio. Okay. Station. Wow. And we're like, did we just? Any station? Yeah. <laughs> That's kind of. Freaking and it was just like again every half hour this commercial would play. That's gross. It's like it's, it's like she you she, this this woman threw her daughter on the bus by saying she's a hoe. Mm-hmm. And right. he's saying. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, yeah, stank ho. Yeah, know. put this cream on; it'll stop that that smell. This commercial brought to you by Thought Cream. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. That's so uh, I'll agree. Show. <laughs> right. yeah. 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 The AG, I the hell. But, I just, you know, <laughs> put extra cheese on the So table. it was just like, so we ended up putting on the Christian station. Yeah, we're done. It's over. Yeah. Christian like, station. Oh, yeah, you can't, you can't yeah. even do that. Like, okay, oh, I it understand. Came it came on the Christian oh. station. But, like, what the frick? It was there's there's no, I mean, like, okay, how can I say, like, okay, business wise, I understand marketing and, you know, you know I mean, you're going to, you got money, you're going to get your product out there. We're going to get this product out there. It doesn't matter who. You know what what? Y'all want to put our product on your station and we paying y'all. If you got you to show our stuff. Yeah. You know exactly. what I'm saying? But, like, it feels like there's Christian girls out there that need it. Yeah. Like, <laughs> the Catholic girls. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like that's. Don't make me bust your name out. Right. Yeah, let's do it right um, now. What, do what? Oh, I'm going to say, do what? Do what right now? You put it on me. Let's do it right now. <laughs> no, not you. He said oh, right. the Catholic girl. But, yeah, I, I, I've seen those commercials, and it's just like, you know, I mean, I I don't know if I want to mess with a woman who needs to put this on. No. That's a bit like, so, if I go to a chick's house... And I'm like, let me go in the music bathroom. You can't go ahead. And I go in there and I see Lume sitting in there like, no, you did it. 
No, he didn't. Like, no, he didn't. Now I'm about to hit Marco and say, bro, I need an interference, bro. You need to hit my phone and tell me my cat's on fire or something. Like, I got to go. <laughs> exactly. I didn't know you had a cat. Yeah, it's on fire. I got to go. Yeah. Like, your cat's on fire. Your, your, cat's, on fire. <laughs> your cat's on fire. I got to go. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So, I mean, um, we're in a new time, man. Like, I mean, even watching some of the cartoons that my son watched, Adam Turner, I'm like, wait a minute. All the, in the window, there are cartoons now. So mm-hmm. in the window, like, you know, other than it was a, uh, some children was like, yeah, I killed him. Oh, yeah. You, you, you I think they talk about killing and stuff. I said, turn. Turn from this crap. Mm-hmm. Like, it's, it's out there in this world. It's like, it's a different world from the 80s to now. Like, yeah. it's a lot. See, it's a lot here's the thing. Bro. Here's the thing is, the 80s were so discreet. Yeah. yeah, they hid everything. The FCC then got loose in the mold. Oh, they they got paid. They got they said, well, they got paid. Remember who was I? I was telling you. Yeah, I was telling you. I was telling you in the car. As long as you pay mm-hmm. that extra dollar, yeah, you can do whatever you want. Yeah, you want people are paying thousands and thousands upon thousands yeah. Just to, to run their commercial. It's funny that you say that because I remember watching. Um, Sorry, FCC. Oh, um, you can call right, me later. Right, the Conan O'Brien show. Uh, back. Because at the time, you you weren't allowed to use the word shit nope. until after ten o'clock. Yep. So the corner now it's just, show, a, a, just part of the language now. Yes, shit exactly. In the commercials. It's like, are you shitting me? Right. Yeah. Like, well, <laughs> Belly, they, are you although, although, Belly? Yeah. although although that they blocked it out, but paid Manny commercial with the hot sauce. I put that sh- on everything. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? So, like that's even <laughs> back in the day. That was even. Damn it, Bobby! Close. But check this out. This and and we'll, I can look it up and find it. I actually had it recorded at one What's point. That? So I was watching the show, not probably like maybe twenty eighteen. And you remember? Did you ever watch the Conan O'Brien show? Every you know, had, on he had the Andy Richter. Depends who I wanted to laugh at. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, well, he had Andy Richter. The his always his side. Yeah, his catch Yep. Which did you know he was from Grand Rapids? Yeah. No, okay. I didn't. So. Anyway, so they were talking, and all of a sudden it went to him, and he he looks and he's talking about that. I don't know where he's just talking about that. FCC has lowered their standards on that. So he said, "So we don't give two shits." Exactly. Then I was like, "Money." He just swore on cable. Money. Mm-hmm. Money talks. Exactly. Money talks. You got the money, do it. Exactly. Why not? FCC is going to protect you anyway. That's true. Your insurance is going to pay you. Yeah, exactly. Oh, and then that's probably what it was, too. So. Insurance is going to pay you anyway. So, yeah. Hey, you did. Before you get off. Oh, you going to get off? <laughs> Yo, bro. <laughs> Before I get off in front of everybody. Yeah. Um, Man, I, lower the I want you to put... Uh, it's, not a, it's not a song or nothing. I want you to put this on the screen, bro, what I just sent you in your... Uh, All right, hold on. Uh, just, this is the uh, 80s thing. I don't know if y'all talked about it while I was gone, but... I gotta cut some of this off because I got too many. That looked um, like that looked part of the commercial. Honey, you look like a fat. You're a fast girl. Let's take shower and put this on. Right. Gotta, it takes care of the order. You know your thought, but you need to be a clean one. <laughs> There's respectable whores out here. <laughs> right. We're respectable here. Respectable. Oh well, yeah, I can put that on here. Okay. This is a picture. <laughs> that commercial Ooh. flipped me out. Yeah, that was yeah, that baby. sounded gross. Boom. Oh, the boom box. Boom box. I had Crazy. the one that had lights in it. They're oh, make, they're, yeah, God. they're making the beep beep. We actually, Radio uh, oh. we might have those at Renaissance. KRS One. Yeah, walking everybody walking down the street. We were make looking at. Step, step, we were looking at some to to rent out at Renaissance. What is that song? Got the boom in the trunk. Oh, oh, with the boom in the system. No, with the, the, the system? girls, the girls. Oh. I like the man with the boom. In oh the yeah, trunk. yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I remember that. I don't know who that was. That or the was one that boom, I got your boy. Boom, boom, I got your boy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, oh, yeah. Uh, the right. bang. But that was, that was part just of, on the radio, actually. Big part of the 80s is the, the banging systems, bro. The, that, uh, that was just on the radio. It's was it really? Right? Yeah. About? On the 80s station on XM Radio. Think really? About, yeah. I think you said about DJ that. Magic Mike. <laughs> oh, DJ Drop Magic that, Mike. Yeah. Drop that beat. Drop that beat. Drop that beat. Drop that beat. And, of course, Vanilla Ice. Um, who? who? No, <laughs> <laughs> of course, Vanilla Ice. Uh, he, I was watching a video of him talk because he said he hadn't watched the 
uh, Ice Ice Baby video since it was made. Mm-hmm. And he's, you know, talking through it, saying, oh, well, this happened here, blah, blah, blah. And he's always saying, <laughs> you guys know that Miami is the place that invented bass, that really put bass in Luke. those songs. Luke Skywalker. Uh, Luke Skywalker. Right. Yeah. So Luke he's, so he's talking argue, about, yeah. like, that's where that came from, like, Oh, I guess there's like speech. DJ Laz. Oh, I'm on a tractor. Oh my god. A tractor? <laughs> with, a, oh, with two tins in the back. Man, two tins. Boom. 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 Yeah. I have a. You, you in the house talking okay, about Uncle Bob. My Uncle about to pull up. I hear him. Right. I hear him from the street. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, we, yeah. didn't have, we didn't have phones. We had we had bass. Yeah, yeah. bass. Then bass and information. That was. You need. <laughs> that was. Uh, also a way of, you know, you didn't have to honk, honk your horn. When the uncle get here, call the time. Yeah. 396-1212. Yeah. All right, the time is 9.30. Let's bring this out. We talked about this also. Shout outs. Okay. Oh, yeah. Right. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. People do shout outs. Do shout radio. outs on radio yeah. stations. Exactly. I, oh, yeah. Right. They ain't got no time to pay for that shit no they, more. They ain't paying for that no more. They're like, man, we got, we, sorry, man, we were doing shout outs. Oh, we had to put this Lume commercial on here. Yeah. I want to give a shout out to Boom Quickly. <laughs> All right. Quick. Yeah, it's either shout outs or vaginal freshness. Where are we? Going? <laughs> <laughs> you got to make a decision right Who there. pays more? Who pays more? Yeah. The vaginas. The vaginas pay more. <laughs> <laughs> so, definitely. Um, here, kitty, kitty. Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. kitty. Oh, oh kitty, kitty. <laughs> I have no idea what they're talking about. <laughs> I don't. Um, all right, so bad, bro. We, we got about four minutes left because we. It's all good. Well, hey, my leak only needs thirty seconds, so we're okay. good. Right. There we go. Ah, that's a that's a that'll be the best two minutes of your life. <laughs> hey, I did it. Kitty, 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 kitty. Oh, kitty, kitty. I, yeah, that's the uh, hey two two minutes of my life. I made four babies. Thirty seconds. Of my life. <laughs> four babies. Dang. Ooh, I'm, I'm four for four, bro. Mm-hmm. Four, for four. four for four. Four times unprotected. Four babies. Boy, you don't want to go my record. I'm straight. We don't want to. <laughs> right. All right. So, anybody want to put some last minute words in there? Man. Boom. We'll, we'll go that way. Who am I doctor? Counterclockwise. Man, um, it's come a long young. way, man. From the, from just like I said, man, just reminiscing about the 80s, man. Um, socially, technology wise. Oh, way. Um, different. The food is way different. Oh my God! Clothes are different. Prices, morals Prices are, different. are different. You know, yes. but one thing I want to think. The Big Mac was ninety nine cents. Yep. And one thing we forgot—I forgot to mention about the eighties. Burgers were thirty nine. The eighties was when finally biracial relationships were finally accepted in yeah. public. George <laughs> Jefferson. <laughs> oh wait. wait, all in the family. Yeah, the dude on George. Oh, Jefferson. Yeah, yeah, Lady yeah. Kravitz, mama. Huh? Lady Kravitz, mama was on. Uh, or. The daddy. The daddy. The daddy. daddy was on the Jeffersons. I didn't know that. Yeah, the big boy dude. The big boy dude, Tom. What? That's yeah, his dad? Yeah, that's, that's his, his dad. dad. Oh, shit. I didn't know that. Yeah. You know, uh, Slash's dad is white. From Guns N' Roses. How do you not know that? Hey, 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 Slash? Yeah, from Guns N' Roses. Guns N' Roses. Oh, his I'm mom's just, his mom's black, his dad's white. Oh, oh yeah. he had breed. Yeah, oh, it's in that hat. There's a picture he's of his picture. He's a more dominant he got that nap hair. Right. He gets pulled over. But Why did I say nap hair? He look at me. Right. What's up with my hair? Right. I wear my hair back and forth. Don't do that. Don't do that. Dude, don't do that in here, Marco. Stop it. Wow. Teen Spirit, the Brett Magazine. Oh, there's some of the... the look at that. The perfume, Teen Spirit. Oh, um, what was it? Um, oh my God! Stop it! This guy. I'm this Encyclopedia Britannica. <laughs> you wanted to learn a new word or yeah, what? Yeah. You had to bring out the uh, book. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Oh, the one thing that I actually kind of miss doing, and you guys are probably Studying? laughing at me. <laughs> no, phone books. Oh, jeez, to sit on them, to drive. <laughs> no, to look. Cause, hey, I, what's the plumber's number? I know. Uh, hold on. Let me get to page. <laughs> let me get to page five hundred eighty-three. Yeah, the yellow pages. Right. 
Right, or just, just dude, pick, but just pick had, random numbers. But you know what? That was so I'm on Frank calling out of those. But you know what? That was crazy oh, yeah. because you, you, there was no privacy. Because if you look at the white pages, it had the person's name and their address, their, address, their phone number, their weight, their, yeah. their yeah. size, their hair yeah. color, yeah. Their shoe, <laughs> <their> pubic <laughs> hair size, color, and everything. They like, mad. Everything, you know. Like, it was not a, it was, damn. Now, you know, Back then, you didn't have the skin identity. Just go on the phone book. Yeah. I am Marsha. Well, I am Mike Smith. I am like Mike 500 Dan- Smiths on the I phone I am Mike book. Denderall today. Exactly. That, was, that was bad about, you know, in, in my in my day. You couldn't do nothing because if you look up my last name in the phone book, there was only one person. My dad. That's funny because we, and then back in the day, you always thought, oh, that's cool. My uncle's in the phone book or something. Right. So you always thought that I, was pretty I cool. didn't just How many up. fingerprints? And spit prints did you find on a phone book? A lot, bro. Oh, man. Look at your finger tent. All kind of food and shit. Who left the fucking pizza crust? <laughs> <laughs> Who dropped the coffee on that, damn it? Man, y'all know y'all did that, man. When you did on the phone book, man. You should do a video. I was eating. You told me to look it up. Man, let's go over to the flashes and get a new phone You should do a video. I'm pretty sure the Mexican home, they had tamale grease on the phone book. Oh, my God. All right. They <laughs> <laughs> had tamale grease on the phone book. Or red sauce. <laughs> little red sauce. We should do a video of like kids nowadays trying to use old 80s stuff. And see they how, actually how have a video of a, a kid trying to do a rotary phone. Like, what is this? Yeah, what are you pushing? <laughs> There's you no mean? buttons. You have to put money in this and then make a call? Yeah. You know, it doesn't have Wi-Fi on it? When, phone, when phone, yeah. um, the phone booths came out, you put a dime in, call. I can't find that picture. Yeah. Oh, oh right. and it, the yeah. thing said dime. Well, my grandma always talked to the phone. I'm like, why are you talking to the phone? It says dime. Oh, no, that, I used to, my dad used to get, uh, my son dad used to get, uh, um, calls on a, like, interview and shit. Like, he'd be like, oh, yeah, we're going to call you at 1230. He, at that phone. At that phone at 1230. At that phone, and they'd call him, hello. This is really wrong. You're like, what? When, yeah. when phone ID first came out. Oh. It came out. You had color the big, ID. Color ID. You had the big it. old box. Right. Big ass box. And, shit and then it would scroll it. across, and you had to read it real fast. Yeah, to find yeah, who it was. Yeah. <laughs> what is it? Then you knew who to answer and what to answer. Right. Then mm-hmm. that's what people. That's what people start avoiding calls. Back that's in the eighties, where you didn't want to have a call, you take the phone off. Especially when the school wanted to call. Or if I yep. call anonymous, star six seven. Star 69. And then call him back for Star 69. Yeah. You're like, so just call here. Star 69. Somebody gets called. I don't know where that picture went. That's, That's crazy, crazy, bro. Look at that shit. Dude, times yeah. have changed. And if I'm you guys like, haven't, if you guys, I'm going to tell you this my last words. If, if you have not experienced the 80s, not experienced anything of the 80s, I feel sorry for you guys. And you're missing yeah, Because it was the greatest era of them all oh, it was, was because sure. it was lit it, it was, was so many trends that the wait itself, saturday wouldn't be it wouldn't be lit it'd be rocking rocking yeah. right? it was rocking oh, that, oh, that's, especially oh, that's with fresh. this thing. that's fresh yes fresh that's fresh all you little all y'all new age millennials or whatever y'all call yourselves I think all I'm the shit y'all doing right now leggings Jeez. and Nike sweatsuits. Did you ever we roll, done that? Roll, did you ever and roll your pants? Oh, yes. Yeah. Rip jeans and stonewash jeans. We started that trend. We started oh, that's, that. That's, that's, we started all that. Ain't that dudes? Ain't no, that I can try it though. But right? here, autumn hammer pants. Y'all be okay. Well, I don't know if we wearing hammer. Yeah, yeah. I haven't. I haven't seen coming it. soon though. Yeah, well, I'm sure <laughs> some other hairdo coming, coming back. Yep. Hey, yep. The gummy hair. All oh, the hair. Gummy all that shit. That's all that coming back. The twists. Yep. They're all coming back. I'm going to do that when my hair grows again. Hey, speaking of, anybody that wants to give me a free little hairdo, that'd be great. That'd be well, really like braided it. or braided? Braided. Get some braided. Oh, no, a few braiders. Oh, great. Uh, Chiquita. Yeah, Chiquita. Chiquita banana? Yeah. Chiquita at, um... I'm going to keep that joke. Bye. Jake, braid my hair no more. Sorry, honey. No. No, Chiquita, dope. No. No, you she gets you together, but yeah, I think cool. they do most of the braiding though in the in her Capital Zoo store. Remember that's what she said that's oh, what they do right. the locks and the braids. Okay. And they, yeah, she, yeah, but down here they do more of just like the other stuff. Oh, the white people side. Yeah, the Dutch side. The Dutch side. <laughs> right, they do the soft short drive thing. See, this is the second time we, the third time we heard about Kalamazoo. Zoo. I think we all need to take a trip to the Horseshoe uh, Restaurant. Oh, oh you know, know what? Is that still open? I'm saying restaurant. 
Oh, oh my, god. my god. I get it. I All hope right. you have a lot of singles. I actually was listening at that time. I got to play I saved them for that occasion. All right. So we're going to go to that restaurant. Right. Nowadays, when it win A's, where they probably got a garter belt with a uh, a card swiper on it. <laughs> I'm pretty sure they do. Or, or when you say, can you scan this QR code so you can pay me? She's talking about the devil and the cranny. Left cheek. Left cheek. Left cheek. Yeah. Hold on, I gotta put my penis. Wrong button, ass. Hey. Mm-hmm. That's, that's a areola. That, that's a areola. That's the that's Smell your finger. You accidentally hit the eight instead of the one. Smell your finger. Oh, smell your finger. I swear, I swear to God, you won't. We're gonna get banned. All right, so let's all go ahead and log off. <laughs> We're past our time. We, we thank everybody for showing up. We Mine thank everybody for showing up. Oh, bro, it's FCC. <laughs> thank you, everybody, for being on the show. Thank you for allowing me to be on your show. Bro, the the you man, thank you. It was Absolutely, fun. Absolutely, man. Yep. It's real, man. Good to have you here, bro. Much more to come. Dude, we, we need to bring what we had in the vehicle here. Oh, oh we will. We will. Because, oh, yeah. dude, we were nonstop laughing. Exactly. That's exactly was... what we were talking about the other day. It was like, like I told you. And those mm-hmm. that don't like swearing, please just mind your business. Go somewhere else until we can come up with a button that says selective beep. hearing. Yeah. I got to find the beep button. <laughs> so, so uh, Once I find Black Jesus, I'll stop cursing. Yeah. Oh, exactly. Ooh, there, that's a good one. That's Damn. A good one. Jesus went there. Oh, yeah. Man. You know what? And I didn't ever turn my lights on. Right. True story. You didn't take that ugly ass jersey down either. Oh. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'm trying to log off. Sorry, yeah. Tito. My Malik didn't mean I, that. This is probably the craziest face I've ever seen being make right there. Except when he was constipated the other day. But other than that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. Well, I want to thank you. I want to thank everybody for, for tuning in tonight. Appreciate the views. Marcos, appreciate you coming through. Not a problem. Marcos is. Loved it. What are you doing? Wait for my. Hold on. Wait for my close up, Miss Cindy Mayer. That's uh, that's the um, Dr. Evil. Oh, oh, no, he was way up here. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, thank you. Uh, appreciate everybody. Appreciate you, Marco, for coming through. Uh, we got Malik. We already did his close-up. He's done. He's and done I'm sorry, but I'm going to interrupt oh, real quick. No, if you all want to send some presents, some food, whatever, hey, it's my birthday tomorrow. Oh, happy birthday happy to Marco. Happy anniversary to Marco's Wait, man. Say? Um. Uh, his birth anniversary on his birthday, date, birth oh, yeah. date, year to date, um, century to date. Okay, no, I'm just kidding. But uh, <laughs> <laughs> he's turning a whopping, can't call that hot, but he, um, oh, he's, oh, uh, oh, but he's, uh, he's, um, he's, I'm a, up there. he made another, so far so good, another year. We don't, it's only going to get better from here. Yeah, yep. exactly. We got plans. We got some great, great plans. Later, great baby. Plans. I can't wait. We got some great plans coming up. Yep, definitely. And yes, we're, sir. and I'm excited. Man, I'm, I'm, I'm You know what? I'm going to go put all Pointer Sisters out. Oh, I'm, 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 all, I'm, I'm excited. I'm so excited. <laughs> and I just can't. can't hide it. But you know what? That was a, actually a sex song. Oh, yeah. You know what? I never realized that they're the ones that sang, um. We Are Family? No, uh, I heard it the other Let's think about sex and family at the same time. Uh, I'll, I'll, think, I'll probably think of it after the show. But anyways, everybody have a good night, and we'll see you on next month. Oh, not next Monday, because the championship game's on. Next Wednesday. I'm not having a show on Monday, because Michigan's going to win the national championship. There you go. We'll do 15 minutes of fame. God bless everybody. All right, peace out.